Hi Libra, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. Now let's start. First, I will shuffle the deck four times. I will start with what happened in the past, why it all happened, what were the problems, so you better know if this is your reading. So let's see, there was a rejection, someone refused a good offer or a proposal for commitment, for marriage or engagement or something serious. And I think during the mid or going to the end of that relationship, someone lost interest, seemed quite disinterested and may have feared commitment. What are your current energies? You don't like to invest into that connection anymore, but you would like to remain friends with them. Let's see what is affecting you in your subconscious. What is affecting you in your subconscious? The fact that it was a very important connection, it may have been very passionate, but not consistent, on and off, and not reliable. So you may have attraction for them, but you are not sure about the stability of the connection. How do you view the situation with them? You think that uh, one day they may apologize, or you may expect a message of love from them. Let's see about the overall energy. It may have been a third party situation. Also, I'm getting you being quite closed off and not dating much, not wanting to date much. Maybe you are losing confidence in love. You are losing confidence in love. Uh, but I think you you should give option. Uh, you you should give uh, chances to opportunities. It's important to give chances to people that you think your intuition thinks may be a good potential and then decide then being closed off. Let's clarify why the three of cups in the reverse. Mostly I'm getting that if it was a third party situation you're deciding to cut off that connection completely and move away. Yes, here it is again, Eight of Cups. Moving away from a connection that was not, a, that was not working or the other partner was involved with another person. Also, if we get it as an advice, as I said before, it is important to be more open and uh, give chances to opportunities that you may consider uh, like potentials and then not being so closed off. Because Three of Cups in the reverse uh, tells about an energy of a person that is, in lose, is losing uh, trust in love or does not like to date anymore, at least for the time frame of this reading, because of, the, of what happened in the past. Losing optimism in dating new people. Now let's see more details about your focus or what you want to avoid and your hopes. Now your hope is to open a new chapter, a complete, a complete, completely a new chapter <coughs> in your love life. <coughs> sorry, sorry for the voice. So your hope is to open a completely new chapter in your love life. You want to find a better new partner and as soon as possible and it happens if you give dating some chances 
here going back to the overall energy. But what you want to avoid is you want to avoid overthinking so much about the past because when you think about the past, memories, uh, mostly those are bad moments and make you sad. And also you may realize that maybe that connection not only lacked love, but it may have lacked friendship as well. That connection may have lacked friendship, not only love. Let's see about uh, what is uh, the energy of the person that is on your mind towards you. They think a lot about you, but they don't see progress in that connection with you. This person is not the most trustworthy person. They may lie, they may cheat, or not be consistent. And I see them wanting to get your attention again because of their ego. Wanting to get your compliments again, maybe because they have a big ego and take what resonates but maybe this person was in that connection just for the attention but there's something good here that if we see the nine of swords they think a lot overthink a lot at night especially and they feel sorry about the mistakes so despite all those problems, they may feel sorry and bad about their behavior in the past. So they are not easy, they are not uh, calm when they think about the past mistakes in that connection with you. Now let's see, will they take any possible actions towards you for the time frame of this reading? I see them being quite disappointed, ashamed of, of themselves. They are watching you, but not wanting to talk. They are just being silent. So I don't see action from them, at least for April. But they will be watching you. Maybe on social media or asking friends of friends about what's up with your life. Now let's see in the extended how this reading goes. I want to view more about their feelings towards you. How, how do they view you from the outside? What are their intentions and also the energies around you, them and the connection? If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.